I'm driving the YouTube bus to YouTube Planet, where we look at YouTube videos on YouTube. Sorry everyone, just feeling a little silly in the new year. It's time for another edition of Let's Argue, where we take your hot takes, your unpopular opinions, and your tough questions. We respond to the best ones. Just kidding, your takes are awful and they suck. Here we have a top five of Dylan's, uh, starting with Dylan at number five, then Dylan at number four, Dylan at number three, Dylan at number two, and then at number one, Dylan. Frankly, uh, in, you know, if, if you're looking for my opinion here, which I imagine you are, I would put Dylan over Dylan, who would also be over Dylan, but then put that Dylan under Dylan. Uh, and then Dylan, honestly, I don't even know why he even made the list. Dylan should be on this list instead. My balls hurt. Probably because you were stupid enough to pay $8 for a fucking blue check mark. Mainstream Sellout by MGK is the greatest album of our generation. Ha! 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 It definitely isn't, and I think that you are lying for comedic effect, which is why I laughed when I read that tweet. But very important music related question tits or ass? It's ass, bitch. It's always ass. It's ass 100% of the time. If Kanye actually cared about sales and did consistent releases, dropped on time, singles and physical copies along with radio hits, he could have been the biggest rapper ever, but he cares more about making art than sales. He was still arguably one of the biggest rappers of all time, if, if not the biggest at, at at least one point. So I... I don't even know what this argument is. Is, is. Are you just mad that he's not the biggest rapper now? I mean, I think right now there are other things getting in the way. We should let pandas go extinct in the wild. Awful take. Bad take. They're just fucking cute. cute. All music is good. Frankly, I prefer Rate Your Music over allmusic.com. I feel like Rate Your Music is more interesting of a site, generally speaking. The opinions and the community aspect, even though it is pretty chaotic and can be disagreeable at points, is just a more intriguing, you know, sort of like musical discovery experience than, than all music. Um, but you know, to each their own. Eating cold pizza the next day will forever taste better than eating it hot the day that it was made. That's a garbage take, and the reason that you think that is because the pizza that you eat is bad and shit and not good. If you actually ate good pizza, you would enjoy it warm. In fact, you would enjoy it more warm than you would it cold, but because the pizza you eat is garbaggio, you prefer to eat it cold. Why don't you like the viola? Do not thrust the violin, viola, whatever, you know, uh, back and forth beef upon me. I'm not engaging in it. I have no interest in it. I have no horse in this race. Both instruments are great and just cover a different range of notes ever so slightly. We don't need to get in the thick of viola versus violin right now. Isn't there enough going on? Uh, you know, it's 2020 fucking three. Let's have this year be chiller than the last one, please. Zorbing needs to come back. You know, looking at this last picture, thinking of being in that fucking Zorb rolling down the hill with, like, no end in sight is just, like, giving me fucking anxiety. And, um, I, I can't imagine a greater hell, honestly, being that out of control of my physical momentum. Uh, even if I am sort of, like, you know, safe in this little plastic pillowy thing, this does not need to come back. These pictures also don't look that old. It, like, is, is, is this that far in the past? Yeet is like the hyper trap version of my bloody Valentine. I gotta sit down for this one. Oh my... Ah! Brock Hampton should have never kicked out Amir. It changed the band sound. <laughs> it's over! They're done! They're not a group anymore! They've quit! It's finito! It wasn't gonna last forever. Calm down. Let's argue. You need to put more respect on Ween. They're much more than the Ocean Man band? I've, I've never... I've, one, I've never fucking called them that. Two... Uh, I've done a classic review of Ween's music. I enjoy Ween. Like, I even got an email from one of the members of Ween when I did that review, and they said that review kicked ass, and they were happier with it than uh, some of the reviews they had gotten for that record and their past records uh, from other music, journalism, outlets, and so on and so forth. So, uh, what? I don't know what the fuck your problem is. Where are you getting these ideas that, like, I, I don't like Ween or whatever. It, I feel like you're talking to me about the anime and you haven't even fucking read the manga. Bat Joe has no classic albums. Joey Bat has a Hold on there, buddy. This is a gish gallop. You're you're, you're, you're you need to stop right there, buddy. One, one opinion per person. 
please, when, when you're getting in line. This ain't, this ain't fucking, I'm not fucking Santa. You're not sitting on my lap and give me your Christmas list. You give me one hot take, and if it's a good one, I respond to it. You don't give me three shitty ones and expect to get answers to all of them. Sign of the times is Prince's best work. Wow. <laughs> Dick. Daring and brave. How did you come to this conclusion? SZA is less than mid. Not even mid. Less than mid. Um, no. If you're someone who likes people playing instruments, then it's fair to say that the current era of pop music is worse than prior eras. Pop music has never really been the place to hear the best of the best of that anyway. Like, if you really get off on playing instruments, um, you know, there's, there's a lot of other genres of music where you can just sort of like see and take that in and enjoy that. You can just listen to jazz if what you want to listen to is people playing instruments. Um, not that I think jazz is uniquely uh, about people playing instruments, more so than many other genres, because in plenty of other genres, uh, they play instruments too. Why you're harping on this, I have no idea, because there's no shortage of people playing instruments out there. I mean, just go on the internet, there's people playing instruments all over the place. Eddie Vedar is the greatest vocalist. He not be my dear. I agree. Movie soundtracks do not get enough credit. People write them off just as a song from the movie, and we don't let them shine as their own beautiful masterpiece, not to mention uh, the art of scoring and composing for a film gets little to no recognition. Like, we literally give, um, like, Oscars and Grammys for that shit. I'm pretty sure it gets, like, some recognition. People love their OSTs, and honestly, like, if the artist or composer in question didn't want their piece to be known as, like, song from the movie, why would they have affiliated their work with the fucking movie in the first place? Like, I'm pretty sure they're proud of their work being affiliated with the film that they helped work on. In a way, uh, being known, known at all, but you know, at the very least known as, uh, wow, that's that really good song from the movie I like, um, is, you know, maybe not only not bad, but maybe like almost the point or something? <laughs> since like that piece I imagine was meant to complement the film in some way. Honestly, only recognizing, or maybe even mostly recognizing uh, a piece of, you know, music that was meant to uh, pair with a film uh, merely out of the context of that movie, this seems almost weirder. Games OSTs are more creative than most albums. Oh God, there's a lot here. Frank Ocean, top five, bottomless pit, the money store, I said it. I mean, you know. Uh, Biba Doobie overrated. Playboy Cardi, top five trap artist. Lil Durk is overrated. I hate that, that anybody can get like a, a badge now. Pay eight dollars. Look at me. Um, you know uh, my my uh, uh, Playboy Cardi opinions are all of a sudden like um, I don't know more valid than they were a few minutes ago when they were still shit. They're actually still shitty. And also basic. And also boring. And also not interesting. And also get this the fuck out of my face. Your your takes suck. I think we can leave it there. You're the best. Love you. You're you're my hero. You're a hero. And um, I hope you have uh, a good day. Good rest of your day. This has been another Let's Argue. Yeah, it has. It certainly has. Uh, Anthony Fantano, internet, YouTube, forever. <laughs>